lost in the night. We living in life, we don't live in twice, so we gonna get right. Ooh. What's good, y'all, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Today I'm gonna show y'all how I applied this wig for the first time. I don't wanna let y'all know why I did this for the first time because I want you to be biased, but it's my first time. So y'all yeah, don't think, damn, my bitch fucking up. Watch me apply this wig for the first time and continue watching if you wanna see how I achieve this look. I know I said it's an everyday makeup look, but you know, if you remove the eyeliner, it's an everyday makeup look. All right, well, what's good? I stay looking like a nut. Like, I'm gonna apply this wig or whatever, and I already have my hair braided. Sucks on what side, but what side good, you know, whatever. And I sewed it up in the back. I'm gonna lay my hair down as, you know, excess. I'm gonna run cold for you. Okay, this is just a whip cap and it comes with two. And yeah, these small ass things gonna fit on my big ass head. Hopefully. <laughs> oh fuck. I look like a fucking weak character. <laughs> okay. You're going to work today. Nuh uh. Hey, -uh. Oh my god. <laughs> this shit like going in my ear and shit. <laughs> but now when I went up cold, free up. Ah. Okay, I'm gonna apply it on cool. I feel like y'all can't take me serious when I'm looking like this. Ooh. Ooh, that glue powder. Before I cut the cap, I'm gonna just sew it down. And you know, it's not, it's not gonna be perfect. Altar! Time to cut. Cut it up, Koi. Time to cut this fucking cap off. This week. Why I thought I was okay to add this much glue? I don't know. I don't know, sis. Okay, so I had to cut the lace way further back than I thought I was going to because whenever I tried the lace on or the wig on, it would just, the cap would show. Because whoever, the person who had customized my wig when I got it done, just cut too much lace off. But whatever. Okay, now I'm going in with some makeup. Okay, now I'm just gonna go in with some alcohol and a cotton pad and clean off the excess glue or whatever. She said my VVS is so annoying. I bought a coop to spoil it. Okay, the wig I have is from The Real Exotic Hair by E. Banks. If you guys know who he is, that's his name on Instagram or whatever. But it's a bob or whatever. And the knots have already been bleached, it's been plugged, all that. I feel like I look like Cat Williams. But, but. I'm gonna get some bobby pins or whatever and just pin these little hairs back so I can do this whole damn. Alter. So for the glue, I'm using this hair glue. It's from Sally's or whatever. I'm gonna take this glue and you know just put on some paper because I don't like when that glue stick on the back of my hand. I'm gonna take this.
And I do want this to be pin booty straight. Pin booty straight. Eh, pin booty straight. Okay, so I already went ahead and did my eyebrow. This elf pomade and elf angled brush, day one. And I concealed it with LA Girl Pro Conceal. Here, I'm about to just cover my lid with it. For my lids, I'm gonna go in with the Modern Renaissance palette, and then I'm just gonna get this, these browns and a little bit of orange. I'm just gonna do a nude eye, just a basic eye. Yeah, these are my eyes, they're nothing special, it's just one base color because I'm gonna apply eyeliner so I didn't wanna do too much in my eyes and just kinda like everyday look. I don't wanna do all that. For my eyeliner, I'm gonna do a bold wing and I'm gonna bring it into my inner corner and you know, do that little cut eye thing. Yeah. All right, let's see if I can do this on camera. I don't wanna zoom into my waist. And I'm using the eyeliner e.l.f. in the color Midnight. I get ass feel like I look like Kim Petra. But you know, that's the process. All right, I'm gonna prime my face with this Smashbox Photo Finish Radiance Primer. Okay, I'm gonna go in with this Fenty foundation in the color 410. It's a little too dark for me, so I'm gonna mix it in with the lighter foundation. Now I'm going in with the same concealer, Elliot Pro Conceal in the color Creamy Rage and Highlighter. Okay, now I'm just setting my face with what I have left of this setting powder. It's Makeup Revolution Banana Powder. Okay, so I already went ahead and added my lashes and fixed my eyeliner. And now I'm just gonna wipe off the powder with Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Palette in the lightest shade. Nude. And then I'm gonna take this contour stick by Fenty Beauty in the color Truffle. And I'm just gonna contour. And to set my contour, I'm going to use the same Anastasia palette and then go in with the dark and second to dark shade. Kurt. Okay, now I'm going to go in with this 8 eyeliner and just go underneath my waterline. I look real scary. I love it. Okay, I'm going to go in with this small Morphe brush and then I'm going to go into the Modern Renaissance palette and take this red ochre color and just go underneath my waterline with it. Alright, now I'm going to go in with this Maybelline Rocket Mascara and do my bottom lashes. That's how you know there's something in your mascara when you heat up. Yeah. All right, for highlight, I'm gonna go in with this Stila and Becca. You know, this one first, and then this. And then I'm gonna go in with a little brush like this, and then highlight my nose and my eyebrow. All right, for my lips, I'm gonna go in with the L'Oreal Lip Line in the color Toffee, and just line my lips. And then I'm gonna go on with lip gloss from this one, you know, beauty store. All right, there you guys have it. This is my first time applying a wig in my everyday makeup. <laughs> I'm really feeling myself, like for real, like for real, for real. Like I'm a new bitch, new bitch. Damn, I look good. Damn.
I'm feeling myself. All right, make sure you like and subscribe this video and make sure you follow me on Instagram. <laughs> We don't live it twice, so we gon' get right, ooh, yeah